Hi, I'm Rob Syke, and I'm the founder of the AgriTrim group of companies that is now part of the Trimble organization, and I'm involved in global business development. I just got back from the Dimensions Conference, Trimble's international conference, and one of the things that I saw there that kind of blew my mind was the development of autonomous technology integrated into tractors. Now, we've all heard about autonomous tractors and saw prototypes of the major manufacturers rolling out prototypes of autonomous tractors, but what struck me as I I learned more about the components of automation and robotics and guidance was if you take GPS sensors and combine that with things like LIDAR and radar and then integrate gyros and integrate processing and integrate all of this stuff in sensors, you could take old technology like old horsepower or your old tractors because all you really need is horsepower, rubber and, and hydraulics and you could turn that into an autonomous vehicle. So I sat in a, in a case tractor that was completely outfitted with uh, Trimble technology and was running absolutely autonomously. So you'd be able to effectively outline your whole field with guidance lines and this tractor would effectively pull your piece of equipment back and forth autonomously. Now think about that for a second. If we put the sensors on the implement so that the planter or the cultivation unit or the whatever you're using so that the implement implement is actually the one sensing the, the soil depth and, and sensing the drag or the slip or the contour, it sends a signal to the tractor and that tractor could be 20 years old and running completely autonomously. So the cab is ugly or the tractor is old, it doesn't matter. All you need is good hydraulics, good horsepower, outfitted with, uh, with uh, the technology that would turn it into an autonomous vehicle and effectively what you've done is leapfrog old technology straight into the future. To me that was really exciting and since I've seen that my brain literally hasn't shut down with the possibilities of what it could mean for farmers. Now this technology that I saw at Dimensions with autonomous tractors is still in its infancy stage. There's still lots to come but it gives me a glimpse as to where Trimble is headed with the technology and, and gives me great excitement um, because I think the possibilities are really endless for farmers we're going to have to wait a couple of years yet to see it unfold, but God, if they can do uh, driverless cars, uh, surely we can have driverless tractors on farms. This video is brought to you by Farms.com.